spirit for the Lord. I can't turn down. Talking too much bread. Time for you to learn now. Up to what they hear and get offended by the word now. They're not teaching you to keep the commandments. You shouldn't be listening to them, Noel. Right. That's what the Bible says. That's not me. I'm trying to look out for your soul. I'm giving you the word of God. Yes, sir, yes, sir. So, so let's see, let's see, let's go into another thing. What does Christ look like? We're supposed to be like, kind of, uh, like, you know, like, uh, Middle East, kind of uh, image, something like that. He said a Middle Eastern image? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Like, uh, you agree? What color is he in the Catholic church? Kind of, right. Uh, what, what, what color is he in, in the church that you go to, or in the Catholic church? Me too. Black over there because that's not, that's, uh, that's a black church where, uh, where I go. Okay, what, but what does Jesus look like in a Catholic church or in the church on the church that you go to? He's black. He, he look he looks black in the church. Yeah. They have a black image of Jesus in the church. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Pretty much. No, you just said he was Middle Eastern. Well, you know that kind of. Image. So let me ask you this: Which one is Jesus? Which one is Jesus? The right or the left? Well, what have you been taught Jesus looks like? None of them. Well, you know. What have you been taught he looks like? Of them. Like, this over here. like that. But um, a brown, a brown skin. The brown skin man with long hair. So basically, he's just a Middle Eastern dude. Well, you know, like, um, so he's supposed to, he was born yeah, over there, you know, he like, um, like, um, like those people over there. Okay, so check this out, Noel. That's another thing you got to be able to identify. That's another lie you've been taught in your church. That's another lie you've been taught. Watch, we're gonna show you. The Bible tells you what Jesus looks like. So let's see, according to God, according to Jesus, what he looks like. Read the book of Revelations, chapter 1 and verse 14. Verse 1, the revelation of Jesus Christ. The word revelation means to reveal. This is the revealing of Jesus Christ. Verse 14. So let's see what Jesus looks like. Read. Verse 14, his head and his hairs were white like wool. His head? No, he's fine. He's, no, no, he's good. He's good. So his head and his hairs were white like wool. Right? Okay, so what people have woolly textured hair? No. What people have woolly textured hair? When you think of wool, you think of, you said what? Black people have woolly textured hair. Okay, cool. Let's stick with that. Brother James got a question as well. Okay, my brothers, stick with me, but we'll get to your question in a moment, right? But let me ask you this. What is, what is for the most part, what do our people think Jesus looks like? They think he looked like, but I know he looked like me. He looked like you. Okay, okay. You know what the Bible says that? Yes, I know that. Okay, okay, so let's see. Let's let's go through the scriptures. That's what we're going through right now. Read that again. His head and his hairs were white like wool. Well, yeah, so we can identify that's black people here. They have woolly hair. Like lambs, like like sheep. You can even go to, so you can even go to where God we, we got you, we got you. Stick, stick, stay with us, stay with us. Read that. No, no, I'm, 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 as white as snow. And his eyes was a flame of fire. So he has woolly hair and it's white. So again, you look at this. Christ does not have woolly hair on this picture. This this false image, he has straight hair. And is his hair white? Is that hair white? Yeah. Yeah, he's kind of white. No, is his hair white? Yeah, kind of. His hair? That's not white, that's blonde. Right. That's brown hair. Right. Is his hair is his hair white, James? No, it's not white. So it says his hair is woolly and white. It's, it's a woolly texture and it's white in color. That's what Jesus' hair looks like so far. Okay, keep on reading. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. And his eyes were as a flame of fire because according to Genesis 49 and 12, it was prophesied he'd be coming drinking wine. Read. And his feet like unto fine brass. His feet like unto fine brass. So what? your feet are the same color as the rest of your body, right? Yes, okay, so check this out. What color is brass? Brown color. Would you agree with that? Would you agree with that? Yeah. It's brass. Okay, so it's brown. So we identify that Jesus Christ had brown feet. Now let's see how brown. Is it Middle Eastern brown? Let's see. Read. As if they burn in a furnace. You take a brown color and you, you take a brown anything and you burn it. What color is it? Black. It's black. It's black. So if you look right there, look at that. This had an image of, of burnt brass right here. Watch out. Got the image of burnt brass right here. That looks like so-called black people. That's that looks right. like so-called Hispanics. You see, you know there's dark-skinned Hispanics out there. 
You know those nasty. You know you got a cousin, you got an auntie, you got a, a nephew that looks like that. Right. According to the Bible, Jesus was a dark-skinned man. He would be identified as a so-called black man. So now we have to ask ourselves, if that's what the Bible says Jesus looks like, what has my church been telling me? The wrong thing. The wrong thing. They've been telling you lies. So you have, now you have to, yeah, now you have to question. Well, if they're telling me lies about that. What else are they telling me lies about? Second Corinthians 11. We have to really think about this thing, and then we have to think about the importance uh, and the impact of that lie, of that misinformation. Go ahead, read. The book of Second Corinthians, chapter 11 and verse 3. But I fear lest by any means, as the serpent beguiled Eve. Through his subtility. So when you think about Adam and Eve in the garden, right? The serpent was there. He tricked Eve. How did he trick Eve? Did he did he put did he put a did he dig a ditch and put a net over it and it said gotcha? No. What did he do? He tricked her with knowledge. With knowledge, with his words. Right. That's what he tricked her with. Right. Read that again. But I fear lest by any means, as the serpent beguiled Eve. Through his subtlety, uh -huh. so your minds should be corrupted from the simplicity that is in Christ. So your minds have been corrupted by the simplicity in Christ. My mind was corrupted from the simplicity that, that was in Christ. Because I grew up my whole life thinking this is what Jesus looked like. Right. But when you read that scriptures for yourself, like we just read it, right? I didn't make that up. We read it together. It says right there what he looked like. Jesus, right. Back up, back up. Back, relax, relax, relax. Check this out. It says... This is what Jesus looked like. That's what the Bible says. This, yep. this is what Jesus looked like. Bring it out. And look, she hates it because we're telling them that Jesus looks like you. That's right. You see that? They run it. They, they hate the truth. They don't want us to know. Jesus so they rather change fight us because we say Jesus, Jesus looks like you. And that means you're the greatest people Jesus on the face of this earth. Bring it out. Jesus can be a girl. Bring it out. Jesus can be a girl. Remember, Jesus if they want to push this image, girl. are they pushing the truth or are they pushing lies? Bring it out. Pushing lines, I right? Am Jewish. So let's see again. I what's the significance Jewish. of that line? Read Revelation, Re Revelation chapter two and verse nine. Bring it Again, Jesus was a Jew, right? Yeah. If was. Jesus was a Jew and he's black, what must the rest of the Jews look like? Bring it That's right. Black. Read the book of Revelation chapter two and verse nine. Bring it I know their works and tribulation and poverty. So our people are the ones that are in poverty. Our people are the ones that live in the hoods. Look right. around us. Right. We're the ones that got the closed down shops. We're the ones that got the shops with the barred windows. Right. We're the ones that have the homeless and drug addicts in our communities. Right. Says, God says, I know thy poverty, thy tribulation. Right. Read. But thou art rich. We're rich because Christ came for you, black and Hispanic man and woman. You Read Israelite out. man and woman. Read. Read. And I know the blasphemy. The blasphemy. Do you know what a blasphemy is? What's a blasphemy, my sister? Don't you don't know? Do you know Noel? Like a lie, like something like that. A lie. What would right. you say? It it's a lie. Right. Okay. It's a lie against God. It's a lie against God. Oh, so right. check this out. So check this out. He knows the blasphemy. It's a lie against God. So the blasphemy, the lie against God, read. Of them which say they are Jews. Of them which say they are Jews. Because what people walk around on this earth saying, hey, we're the Jews. That everybody Hello. identifies as Jews today. Hello. The same people that that woman was. That's right. right. That's right. He said, they identify, let's see what God calls them, read. And are not. They're not the real Jews. That's right. Jesus was black. Right. He was a right. Jew. Right. That means the rest of the Jews are black. That's right. Read. But are the synagogue of Satan. So no well, hold on. It says they are synagogue of Satan. That means they're out here to push the work of Satan. That's right. That's what we gotta be able to see. So if they're coming, they're pushing these these lies to you. What else have they taught you about God? Are they teaching you about God or to follow Satan? Huh? If they're teaching you to follow this, they're teaching you to follow Satan. Bring it out. That's that's what they teach you. Jeremiah, what? Read that. Jeremiah 14 and 2. We've got to be able to identify this. Let's see it. Let's go to another scripture to see. Am I making this up or the other Jews? Or does the Bible say the Jews are black? Read. The book of Jeremiah, chapter 14, verse 2. Oh, Judah mourneth and the gates thereof language. Uh -huh. The Jews are mourning, the gates of thereof in language. Our communities are impoverished. Our leaders, our leaders and our elders don't know who they are. They taught us lies from our youth. Right. Read. They are black unto the ground. What did God just say the Jews look like? 
They're black unto the ground. They're black. That's what God said they are. That's what God said they are. What is nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. Nation is unity. Nation is you. It's nation time. Oh!